start by checking what you have configured for public addressing in your Untangle server. Be sure that the selective public address is used by Untangle or has port forwarded 1194 to Untangle. Now, let's start configuring OpenVPN. Hit Settings. Select Configuring as VPN Server. Click Next to begin. In step 1 you will create a certificate that will be used for the VPN connections. Fill in your organization name, country, state, province and city. In step 2, you export your host or networks that you want VPN users to be able to reach. Now the VPN server is configured. If you want the VPN users to use the internal DNS server, you need to activate the DNS override and specify what DNS servers to use. And be sure to enable the DNS export on the address pool. Creating clients can be done under the clients tab. Hit add. Then specify client name and address pool. The VPN client will not be given an IP until you apply and save the settings. You can distribute the client's view with email or just download and distribute via USB keys or whatever media you want. If you're running Windows 7 or Vista, be sure to run the installation package as admin or have UAC inactivated. Hit next through the OpenVPN installation and approve the additional driver installation.
Be sure to run the OpenVPN GUIS admin, else the routes to push the VPN traffic will not be created. If we open the config file, we will see what IP or DNS name the client will try to connect to. When you run a bridge, you need to create a port forward for port 1194 UDP on your Edge device. You will also need to create a static route for the VPN address pool pointing at your Untangle server. To test the VPN connection, you have to be on a public IP or behind another network. Just hit connect in OpenVPN GUI. You can verify that the correct route has been pushed by running the root print in a CMD window. If it had been pushed, you should be able to reach your bridge untangle server by IP. To view active OpenVPN sessions, hit settings on OpenVPN. To verify that the DNS options has been pushed, use NS lookup.